Okay guys, welcome back to my channel. I've been gone, I don't know, maybe like two days or three. I'm trying to make videos every day, but I get so tired. I get caught up with so much stuff. If you see my shirt flowing in the video, it's because the fan is on and I'm hot. So, and you can see my face is already oily. I powder about eight times a day, for real. That's the truth. I powder eight times a day. Okay, so we're gonna do like a mini haul of all the stuff that I got from Walgreens and then some other things I wanna talk about. Okay, so the first thing I wanna go with is the L'Oreal New Youth Code and this is like a foaming gel cleanser and I got this yesterday from Walgreens. I just wanna try it out. It's like a, it's like a gel base you put on your face in the morning at night. But I only use it at night because I really like using my clean and clear oil free um, facial cleanser with the vitamin C. As you can see I'm halfway gone. I need to purchase another one. And I'm loving this. It's um, bursting beads. I use this first thing in the morning when I wake up. And then I just started using this one last night. So I haven't, I'm not going to make a full review on this. This is supposed to make your skin look younger, more useful, and um, it, it makes your face feel smooth though. But the smell, I'm not too keen with. The smell, I'm not that in love with, I could say. But it has okay, like, you know, like a catchy smell. I don't even know if that makes any sense. But it smells alright. But the smell again, I'm not too keen with. And this was about, I could say, seven dollars, close to eight. And it's like a pump, and it's just like a gel base. So it's. I'll let you know in a week how I feel about it. Um, this I bought the swab I got from Walgreens again, lavender vanilla. If you saw my other video about July empties, and one of my videos I mentioned this same container but with cherry blossom. Now I'm trying the lavender vanilla and it smells really good. It smells like it smells like cocoa butter mixed with vanilla. And it smells really good and I really like it. And the smell lasts all day. Yeah. And this was four dollars I believe. The next thing I've been using for about a week or two not even two, a week or so, the Yardley London Bath and Shower Shower Gel uh, Skin Soothing Lavender Rosemary. It washes away stress with pure lavender oil and rosemary extract. And I love this stuff. It smells so good. It's an oil base. You put it on your body, you wash it. And it smells so good. It smells like lavender and it's like a calming, calming smell. Like a relaxing smell. It's supposed to take away stress. I don't know. I'm still having stress. But it smells good. Still stressed out. And this was $6. And I got this from Walgreens last week. Now moving on to the makeup. The eyeshadow I got was Great Lash my Maybelline. And this is how the wand looks. I get this. I like it because it's not too long and um the wand is really good and it really um it doesn't lengthen my eye uh, lashes. I'm not gonna say that, but it makes my eye lashes bigger and it makes it look fuller, I could say, and it um, separates my eyelashes so it doesn't clump, you know, like, um, clumps together. So that's the good thing I like about this eyeshadow, I mean, mascara. And I paid, I think, $5 for this at Walgreens, don't quote me. The next thing I got was this eyeshadow palette from Wet n Wild. And it has, one, two, three, four, five, six, eight, eight eyeshadows in it. And uh, if I can get it open, oh, the applicator fell. Um, it looks like this. Okay, this is the brow bone. This is the eyelid. This is the crease. These two. And this is the definer. The two on the bottom. So I use the Mitch and Max. I don't usually go by what the palettes say, but if you like want to, it. It's written on it. And the colors are really nice. I'm feeling this green. It's like an army color green. I like it. And I'm liking this one. And it has shimmer in it. 
so that's how it looks and I'm really really liking it I'm really liking the definer color it's really pretty it's like a grayish bluish purplish color so I really like it and this was five dollars at um what um at um uh, Walgreens the next thing I got was this Fergie um, lipstick now the only thing I can say about this lipstick is that I don't like the way when I first got it the packaging was nice it was silver but now the coloring is coming off so you can no longer see wet and wild or Fergie's initials I think was on it and I don't like it now but the color I'm wearing is from Fergie and I really like the color I like plum colors and this color is really nice I'm gonna swatch it so you can see this is how the color looks like that and I really, really like this color. It looks to me similar, not so similar, to the Milani Sangria color. To me, it looks a little like it. You know what I mean? So, this is the Wet n Wild from Fergie. Okay? This is the Sangria on the bottom. So you see how those two look a little the same, like like the Sangrina looks a little darker to me and the Fergie, I mean the Fergie right here, I'm sorry, looks a little, little lighter I meant and the Milani looks a little bit darker to me, I don't know, I'm not good with saying colors but the comparison, it looks similar, they really do look similar, like they're the same, don't they? It look a little similar. It's just that this is a little this one looks a little darker and this one looks a little lighter. I'm not sure what you guys think. Um also yeah. So these are all the things that I have purchased. Also I put my dog in bed. I'm not gonna go up downstairs and get it and bring it and show because it's too much work. But thank you for watching my video. Please subscribe to my channel. Everything I put here was my own money. I don't get paid to do these reviews. I do these reviews from the bottom of my heart. Because I like to do reviews. And this is a hobby for me. This is not like, you know. You know, this is like a like hobby. Anyways. Um, I love buying stuff. Um, my makeup from pharmacy. It's great. And I don't see anything wrong with it. I do like high-end makeup. I do like cheap makeup. Whatever I can afford, I will buy it. <laughs> I don't have any, um. I don't have any, you know, I don't have, you know, whatever I feel, I couldn't get the word out, whatever, whenever I feel like buying high-end makeup, I'll buy high-end makeup, but right now, I'm just going to stick to my budget and buy my little discount prices at Walgreens, CVS, Dwayne Reed, Rite Aid, and nothing wrong with them, you know what I'm saying, so, it depends on the product, how the product works on you, you know, no one's going to go to Unistream and go, oh, yes, you're wearing the Nay brand, MAC, eyeshadow yes no nobody's not gonna worry about that it's more things in the world to worry about than expensive things it's just materialistic it's just you know you wear it on your face the most important thing is your family your health and working and making money and savings that's the most important thing more than anything Anyway, I'm going into a completely different rant, and it was supposed to be a haul, I'm so sorry, but I'll do, like, you know, a um, video on that or whatever. Anyway, please subscribe to my channel, like, comment, um, do whatever you want with this video, um, so that's really it. I'm going to make another video. I'm actually moving in two weeks, so I'll make a apartment tour. I haven't made an apart house to it. I live in a big, big house, so I have um, how many bedrooms? One, two, three, four bedrooms. Three. It's just a big house, you know. It's really big. So I'll do like a house tour. It's just that I don't like to do these things because I don't say I'm bragging. Oh my God, you're bragging about what you got. But I'll do it anyway. I got a quick request from people to do um, some videos like that, some tag videos. If you haven't seen my tag video, go check it out if you want to. I'm not forcing you. Um, thank you again for watching the video and have a great, great day. Right now, I'm going to go lay down. I have a huge headache. And 
I'm starting right again. Okay, bye.